welcome to the stream. Those watching retrospectively after the point, uh, start a little early just so we can get everybody in ready to go before the three o'clock uh, broadcast. Let's see if we can get the chat up and working. Let's try that now. Uh, is it working? Yes, it is. Here we go. So, just as we wait for everyone to join in, if you're enjoying this, don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave a comment if you're feeling that way inclined about something that you may have enjoyed during the episode or past episodes. Also, um, if you want to email the show and you haven't got the ability to do so, maybe you're too young, like many of these young people have. We got some artwork from Carter yesterday, uh, RIP Wayne the Dog. Sad moment, yes it was. Um, so if you want to email questions at unofficialcontrollerpodcast.com, maybe use mum and dad's email. If you're a fully fledged grown up, feel free to knock yourself out in the comments or obviously on the email. We also do a weekly podcast about all things gaming, retrospective and new. Um, so some people started coming in. Welcome one and all as you arrive. Um, here we are, this is where we left ourselves after yesterday's, oh, I don't know what to say, uh, sadness fueled episode at the loss of Wayne the dog. If you're tuning in for the further adventures of Wayne, I'm sorry that didn't happen. Uh, I'm sorry about that. It's hard keeping myself alive, let alone a canine friend. But uh, I'm sure it will all come together. You can see me standing in front of the marvellous looking wood hut that we all created yesterday on the stream. Uh, not too sure about the roof, but do you know what? It's somewhere to keep the rain off our heads. In today's episode, we're gonna go into a little bit more detail about how to make this place look a little bit more homely. Stephen, good afternoon. I'm gonna to refer to you, Red Dot, as Stephen. Now I've made all the mental links in my mind. Uh, how are you? I hope you're well. Thank you for tuning in. Uh, again, to all those that are joining us now, we'll just wait until uh, Mark.GarageUp came and she can't get enough uh, of the Minecraft stream. Fair play to you. Um, just waiting for the room to fill up. Started a little bit early so I could make sure the chat was working and we we're all good to go. Um, witness the Oscar's been super excited about this, says Rachel Hill. Well, very good. Well done, Oscar. Cool. I'll call you George. I'm well, thanks mate, you okay? I am very well, uh, Stephen. Doogie's here. Hello to Game Boy Matty. Once we get to the three o'clock point, we'll do the shout outs. Been inundated with shout outs from all the people around uh, the world who have been watching uh, me do a little bit of a let's play in Minecraft. The story of Wayne the dog. Apologies to poor uh, Wayne fans out there, but I'm sure during the course of this let's play, We'll find another hound. Uh, comments below on what you want to call him. Uh, hello, everybody. There's me waving with a piece of wood uh, as we all arrive. Three minutes to go, and we'll kick it off. I am dangerous with these backwards controls. Oh, dear. And I'm going to fall off a cliff one of these days. Stacy is here. Harry's here. Smashed homework school, so he's ready for this afternoon. Well, that's what this is all about. Uh, I'm not I'm not advocating alcohol in the grown-ups, but Stacey, you can now pour yourself a glass of whatever vintage it happens to be. Chateau de Pat, 1924. Pull it up from the cellar and pour yourself a glass. I'm sure you can. Uh, to those that are joining us, don't forget to click subscribe. Uh, Daddy Zilla's with us. Morning to Daddy Zilla and Devin Zilla, all the way over in the good old United States of America. Um, thank you for joining us. Um, so the grown-ups can kick back. Get a little bit of education in Minecraft, so when little Jimmy comes through and says, how do you make this and how do you make that, you can steer them right, can't you? You can look like a hero in their eyes because you watch this. Uh, so standing in front of the wonderful looking uh, creation that we made yesterday, our little wood hut on top of the hill, starts of a mine in the background. It all went a little bit sour yesterday when our favorite canine passed away. Uh, Daddy Zilla says he needs the education. Well, you know, Devin Zilla's burgeoning in Minecraft skills, sir. You can learn together through each other, can't you? So it's time for the grown-ups to kick back, 
keep a little eye on what's going on and the youngsters can get a lesson. Obviously, if you want to know how to make armour, that was in one of the early episodes. If you want to know how to make a shield, that was too. If you want to know how to make a wonderful starter home, because let's face it, this stream started with me living in a mud hut, because this whole series is filmed on hard mode, in survival mode. No creates. We have to harvest all of the material. Uh, Red uh, can still hear Wayne crying. Um, so can I. Your comment yesterday of the rain being his tears haunted me even today, where in the UK it's been raining uh, on and off all day. So let's hope everyone's having fun and they're good to go. One minute and we'll do the shout outs for all the people that have been enjoying the content that we've been creating and then we'll launch deep into our Minecraft adventure. Um, don't forget to press that like button. Whoever just clicked subscribe, I'm your new number one fan. Uh, it made me feel good. Um, so thank you for doing that. Whoever just clicked like, well done. Thank you for doing that. Again, it made me feel good. Um, maybe more people could learn from these Minecraft tips. I don't claim to be a professional, but I spent an awful lot of time in Minecraft. So as we approach, it's three o'clock, so let's do it. So, shout outs. In order, Daisy Digby, Carter, Dougie, Oscar, Lois, Harry Traguno, Mason the Fortnite Pro from Digby, it's a hell of a long name, Amy, Hannah and Ben, Devin Zilla, Daddy Zilla, Nathan and Ronan, Max, Charlie and Oliver, Max apparently has got the after name of the Minecraft Master, Game Boy Matty, I hope you're doing well, Young Daniel Ridge, Alex and Anna, Kane Newbie, and let's just say this, we're all good in the wood. Here we are. Wayne Wood. Like I say, don't forget to uh, like and subscribe. So what we're going to do today, today's episode is all going to be about making our home a little bit nicer. Just some of those finishing touches. So let's just check inside what we've got in the... Okay, so we're going to need to get some cobble because I've had a plan. You know, this house is going to be nothing without a fireplace to keep our bones warm. Um, during the evenings when we come back to convalesce about a hard day's mining here in Minecraft just gently trying to tease away the outer edge here because I quite like the uh, effect of this outcrop just outside of our house it's a little bit of a mine area it's also a wood all the natural resources one could want to um, have at hand and we can probably expand some of this area and start creating a farm because there's plenty um, of um, natural resources here. It's getting dark, so I'm, I'm going to risk sleeping. There we go. Oscar is a chicken businessman today. So I'm gonna, this must be uh, in relation to Oscar's own playthrough of the mighty Minecraft. So one thing we're going to try and create is a chimney, a working chimney, with smoke coming out of the top. Um, what more could you ask for? So we're going to put, here in a moment we'll create a campfire. We'll pop that there. In fact, we'll borrow this out. The only time that you can break glass and not get in trouble, smash. There you go. It's all good. Um, and we'll keep piling these up. Now campfires... We're going to make those shortly. Their smoke rises for 10 blocks. So I'm not that great at maths, but something tells me that this house is not 10 blocks high, so we should still have smoke coming out the top of it. Um, very gently positioning in that there. Have we got some dirt in the inventory? Of course we have. Uh, let's just swap that there. And as I said yesterday, dirt is a great tool for using as scaffolding because the good news is you can knock it down when you're done um, and you can jump and place, jump and place, that's how it gets done. Uh, we'll make this chimney a little bit higher. Retro Gamer Thomas is sorry is late. Thank you for turning up. Full stop. End of story, I say. Uh, hopefully Millie's joining with you uh, as well. So shout out to Millie. 
Uh, she'll be forever known now as the inventor of the Milliberry. Not the inventor, but certainly the discoverer of the Milliberries. Better late than never retro, as, uh, as Red says. And she also taught me pick berries. There you go. Isn't that fantastic? So now we've got the chimney on the side of the house. That seems to be pretty serviceable. We need to make sure we've got the following items. So we're going to need to make some more planks. And we're going to need to make some sticks. I believe that should be enough to make the campfire. Let's just see if we can find it. There it is in the crafting menu, just so the PC players know what I'm talking about. Looks like we need a piece of charcoal, some sticks and some logs. So we're nearly there. Let's, there's a creeper there. Do we dare? There's two creepers. I'm going for it listeners. We, let's, let's get our morning exercise in. There, there's another one around the corner. This fella's trapped, so let's take advantage of him. Oh, he didn't explode, did he? We're getting good at this, gamers. He just did explode. Well, fair enough. There's the other one. He didn't take any life, which is good news. I always get excited, press the wrong button, don't I? Let's face it, I need to just keep my cool. Here he is, little creeper. I'm not going to give you the chance to explode, friend. I'm not going to do it. There we go. Once more, that's where you get gunpowder from. Um, let's collect some more of these. This is what we came here for, the trees. Millie's here of the immortal Millieberry fame. Like I say, if you're enjoying this, if you haven't already, like, subscribe, tell all your friends, get them here. Um, and let's grow the Minecraft family. Uh, the OGs of us will know about Wayne the dog. The others, they won't, will they? They just won't. Um, keep mining. Hopefully I kept that piece of charcoal. Hopefully that'll work. I will have to mine for some coal. Just do Don't move when you're mining, because otherwise all your hard work is down the drain. Okay, there we go. Collecting up as we go. We're also going to need some sticks because I'm thinking about what's a fireplace without a pitcher above it. So I think we've got all we need. Let's just find out. Yes, we have. Campfire. Again, for the PC players, three sticks, bit of charcoal, three logs underneath. That's how that gets done. And now if we have, there we go. So if we place that in there, smoke rises. Let's go outside. Can make that a little prettier in a moment. Look at that, gamers. Look at that. We should be suitably proud. Wayne's Memorial Garden, just on the side there, still in full effect. The first flowers we saw after Wayne's unfortunate and untimely death. But there you go. Okay, you came here to watch some Minecrafting. So let's make some more torches. How many have we got available? Uh, 24. We don't need any more, do we? Oh, it's raining. Let's shut that door. Keep it out. So now, as Wayne's tears pour down on Wayne's wood, we know that when we get inside, we're going to have a nice looking fire to get round. Absolutely beautiful scenes. Uh, to denote the entrance to the mine, for now, we're going to put these here. Um, and we shall we shall dig down. Now we're going to be looking for some iron again. Um, oh, let's... Have I got any wool? I think after my sheep massacring yesterday, I probably have got some wool. Let's just find out. Wool. Yes. Okay. So we'll make some planks and some sticks. Okay, we get a little distracted, don't we, games? But it's all good. Um, sticks, and we'll get the wool from outside of the Retro Gamer Thomas loves the chimney. Well, thank you very much. Not bad. Not bad at all. I think he could do some work on the inside just to finish it off, but beggars can't be choosers. Um, why can't we make this? What are we missing here? Uh, we can. No, we can't. Wool. More sticks needed. Love that chimney. Uh, let's make some more sticks. 
For that we need more planks, so we'll need to make some planks. Bear with us, it's all worth it in the end. Let's watch it happen organically. None of this happens offline, so I'm sure you won't have it any other way. Painting. A good thing about these paintings is, no matter how you uh, apply them, there's different paintings each time, so don't forget you can have a multitude of scenes above your fireplace in your Minecraft home. Holy moly! Of course, obviously, depending on the space, they do get quite big. Out of nowhere, that was a big one. And it's gonna, if you keep randomly doing them, I think we're going to end up with something like that, aren't we? Oh well, that'll do. Kung Fu, one more time. Let's try it here. Donkey Kong! A skeleton in a box, or a boat, whatever that was. You need a painter of Wayne. Well, I would love for that to happen. We've got to keep trying. I don't know if you've got the patience to watch that all episode, but we'll keep going. Um, we'll keep working that. Every day we'll change it. When we get back, we'll change it again. So as I said, when you're mining, don't forget to take your torches because it gets pretty dangerous down here. The enemies spawn in the dark and that's... Oh, it's still pickaxe, isn't it? We're wasting it in a way, but we don't mind. We don't mind as we collect up. Now, I always like to mine downwards in steps so you can get out in a hurry if you need to. thought that was a skeleton at the front door, but it was just Wayne's flowers. Uh, there we go. Just changing direction a little bit, just to vary it up. Um, so, mining basics. We're looking for steel and other precious materials that are a much needed commodity in uh, Minecraft. So, oh, what am I doing wrong? I made the biggest mistake you can make in Minecraft. I went down two blocks. Top tip gamers, you can only jump one. As we descend down, I like to do it in this sort of a way, so we can uh, spiral staircase it down. Those that watched episode zero know that I went all the way down to bedrock and things got a little bit scary, but we will uh, we'll continue on forward one more and that should allow us to come round on ourselves maybe one more there we go should allow us to come round on ourselves a wonderful looking establishment this is becoming safety in this mine is going to be key obviously in the earlier episodes we, we stumbled across a cave and we 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 didn't take the proper safety precautions and our friend our friend Wayne the dog met, met a very pretty horrific end, I'll be honest, at the bottom of a um, of a water stream inside of the mine, which didn't go well, uh, most especially for Wayne, but all that broke. Okay, so we'll always have these lessons, probably every episode, because we need to make another stone. I tell you what, if this keeps happening. I'm going to get upset. I've made a boo-boo here somehow. Uh, those eagle eye games will probably know what I've done wrong. Um, and we need that out, don't we? As well. We need a bit of headroom. Any minute now. If you mind stone without a pickaxe, as someone said yesterday, it just disappears. Don't forget your high-vis vest and your health and safety first. Absolutely. Uh, that's how bad things happen. You always got to be prepared. Just close that door. Food's looking a bit dicey as well. Um, we've got a stone, we've got a wooden pickaxe, and we've got some material in there. We've got the glass from yesterday for making the house. Uh, where is. We've got food in here, plenty of. Let's take these chickens, carcasses, stick them in there, which should give us a hearty snack. Uh, once again, all the younger viewers, Daisy Digby, Carton Druggy, Oscar and Lois, Harry Traguno, Mason the Fortnite Pro from Digby, Amy, and ha Amy Hannah and Ben, Devin Zilla, 
and uh, Daddyzilla, Nathan and Ronan, Max, Charlie and Oliver, Max is the MC Master apparently, Game Boy Matty, Daniel Ridge, Alex and Anna, Kane, Newbie. And the saying that we have, all good in the wood, because we found ourselves living in Wayne Wood. Uh, Wayne Wood. I've given myself a tongue twister that no one wants to hear me say. Um, we're living in Wayne Wood. It's time for bed. Stand on your bed, kids. That's how you do it. You immediately fall asleep straight away. Maybe the rain subsided. Who knows? Let's have a look outside. The good thing about that is the hostile mobs burn in the sunlight. Now, one thing to be careful of, gamers, is the... Um, if they can hide in shade away from said sun's burning rays and they can cause you a problem when you're what do you want i'm not ready for a new pet friend yet still in mourning so i'm out here you know get away from it or get away from the rat race look at this millie's taught us how to sustainably look after ourselves fantastic we've got the berries the millie berries I'm glad sleep doesn't take that long in real life. Well, the thing about run, let's just eat. The thing about um, sleep, Red, is how long does it take? One Again, one of those philosophical questions that we may never know the answer to, but it feels like it takes not very long, but in actual fact, it takes quite a long time. Um, I've stood on the poisonous berry bush, like them apples say, skeleton, you raise your shield by crouching, we progress forward, and there we go, we pushed him into the sun, and the works, the sun's rays, it's done the work for us, oh dear, things aren't looking good, that is a pillager, a hostile pillager, now, oh god, there's loads of them. I might have done something really daft here, viewers. Because we may initiate a raid here. We have. Oh, goodness. Okay, so what happens if they come to your house? Um, we've got a crossbow out of it. That's good news. Um, they come to your house, and if you attack them, they put a curse on you. See, can you see it there? Which means more will come, because Minecraft thinks, oh, he wants, he wants to play fighting games. So, yeah, that's not great. Good news is, if you kill a pillager, you should get their banner. There it is, pillager banner. Uh, and you can pop those on your wall. Very much getting a, there we go. Proud of ourselves. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pray. Still got 18 torches. I'm going to pray more don't come while I'm busy in the mine, and I'm going to use that as a reason to go to your house. Don't you worry about it, Rachel. Get off my land. Get off my land. That's right. That's what I said, and I meant it. Uh, let's dig further down. These bubbles, to signify you're cursed, can be a little bit frustrating and distracting, but at the end of the day, we'll survive. Hopefully you guys can persevere with that. Uh, dig further down and further down. We're looking for iron, which is what we really want. Um, how are we gonna do that? Let's get those torches in the quick menu. Put another one of those up, because we don't want any nasty surprises down here. Uh, this mine's gonna be a thing of beauty when we're done, isn't it? I think I'm gonna frame it with some wood. Um, stanchions either side of the entranceway just to make it look a little bit more mining uh, keep going keep going keep digging obviously there's some benefits to this those viewers that uh, how long does a curse last or is it I don't know something tells me do I get a, a notification somewhere uh, maybe someone can let me know I think it's a good 20 minutes so we're going to be feeling the pain of that quite some time. It brings them on. Could even be 40 minutes. Either which way, it's not something that goes away soon. 
the Gaming Vikings. Hello guys, how are you getting on? Well, I think we're doing okay. Thank you for joining us. Again, to the new joiners, don't forget to click that like and subscribe button. You never know, we might attract some more people to our Minecraft family. As we say, top lessons in Minecrafting. If you're new, we've got an episode zero. We've got an Oh dear, that's the end of that. So, let's take some of this cobble that we've managed to extract. Once again, dirt block. Let's see what's happening here. Made a right uh, conundrum for ourselves. Rachel also has a chimney as well. Right. What am I doing? Up and up and up we go. Careful of the holes that you've made in the ground. And every time you do that, you've got to take a block out above you. Is this going to be ongoing all the way up the mine? Hopefully not. Uh, comedy of errors for everybody involved. Yes, it is. Um, just for comedy value, I chucked myself down it one more time. Let's pop that there. Let's take this out. Okay. Let me know in the chat if you want me to continue mining or if you want me to brave the outside world and go find ourselves another pet or for some fighting adventures. I think we've got enough material now to make ourselves a stone sword. Uh, how are we going to do that? We need to go to the crafting table and we shall make go to weapons. Those playing on PC, two bits of cobble with a stick, job done. While we've got a spare, let's make a an axe as well. What should we do? How are we going to... One thing we didn't do for Wayne is we didn't make a grave, did we? We didn't make... He's, he's already... He's, he's, unfortunately, his body is in the mine that we left many, many miles away. I wonder if we can pop this here. A little bit of something to remember him by. Bless Wayne. Uh, we're going to try and get to the top of this. I googled long, how long a curse lasts. It's about an hour. Okay, gamers, so... <laughs> Uh, that should keep us uh, entertained for a little while. What curse do you have? I have the pillager curse. So, yeah, things could get a little bit fruity back at the ranch. I'm sure they will. Um, we're going to try and climb to the top of the hill above our house. Two reasons. Because we want to go on an adventure, but we don't want to lose all the hard work that we've put in. So we'll keep climbing. There we go. There's the plateau. Up and up and up we go. So we want to be able to see something for some distance. So let's get the dirt blocks, put those there, um, and we'll pillar up. Drink some milk and sort it for you. Unfortunately, we're not that prepared. We're only early days into our Minecraft playthrough. That is pretty high up. Yeah, it is. I didn't think this through, did I? Because... Crouch. Everyone's hearts in their mouths right now, including mine. Didn't. There we go. We can come down. Take off crouch. If you're new to Minecraft, if you use the crouch, crouch function, you can... Uh, you don't fall. It's much more's joined us again. Welcome, sir. I hope you're well. This is going to end up being a cross. This is for Wayne. Let's make it a cross. Crouch. I'm in crouch now. When you're in crouch, you can't fall, which is good news for all. And there. Put that there. Behind the scenes, from a distance, it should still look like a cross. There we go. Two and two. Is that correct? Yes, it is. Oof, that is a long way. I've got myself in a right conundrum here, haven't I? What I'm going to do... Eat some berries. It's much more still getting over the last video. You and me both and everybody in the stream, it's much more... Uh, we've got Gaming Viking letting us know that they play... Probably too much Minecraft. I think we're all a little bit guilty of that. It's one of those great games. 
fun for all the family and there's plenty to learn for the experienced gamer and for the novice gamer probably much like myself but hopefully through the medium of me we can all learn a little bit of something I'm making a meal out of this guys but I don't want to die simple as that okay we're never going back up there again much like in Castaway he often looks up to that tree that had given some dark memories uh, and we are doing the same there we go and there there we off of crouch we can drop down another level I'm gonna risk it oof little bit of fall damage but we're okay look at that okay probably gonna make more sense from the other side but for now that will oof crikey well let's just hope that's visible for miles around um, there we go there we go gamers so we've got our little goat like path around the side hoppity hop so now for quite some distance now we should see the Wayne Memorial high high above Wayne Wood all good in the wood as the saying goes that we've now coined have a little sleep have a little slurp of our beverage okay the cross of Wayne do you like that retro gamer Thomas let's look up shame that tree foliage gets in the way but it does mean that when we go out for an adventure as we're planning on doing before we go let's pick the sustainable millie berries what's going on here it's because I'm crouched it's not there we go got the millie berries we've got a hearty breakfast to get us through the day let's have another quick munch on those everybody eat together Let's uh, have a little look over what's over the horizon. Some people, they never get out of their village that they grow up in. My goodness gracious me, Millie berries everywhere. Let's get them. Let's get them all. There we go. We can always climb to the top of that mount to get ourselves another hearty breakfast in the morning. Uh, no, that didn't work very well channeling our inner Stallone again, listeners, viewers, gamers, whatever, ooh, that's tempting, that's tempting, remember, top tip on mining, put your, uh, this is giving me PTSD flashbacks to when we lost Wayne, but put your, put your torches Oh my, oh my goodness no. Uh, have we got a bow and arrow? We have, we've got nine arrows. Can we do it? Remember yesterday we talked about the fall of shot? There's a lot of dead things down there gamers. Can we just nick him in the eye? Let's see if we can. Yes. Taking the creeper down, one shot at a time. He's down. Okay, we did well. I don't know why I keep doing this to myself, gamers. I really have no idea. But uh, part of me likes the adventure of Minecraft, even though it's enough to scare the living wits out of you. Let's see if we can... Uh, can we get down? If we get down, can we get up? For Wayne! We did it. Did you hear that? The battle cry for Wayne. Let's slap some, let's get this place illuminated ASAP. Little did we know, right, no, George, that's not how you do it. Little did we know, right under our noses, always putting torches on the left. So when you want to leave, that's a spider. He's got nothing but eating on his mind. He's down. And the thing he was planning on eating was us. There's another one there. See, they've been existing quite happily in this little uh, world. But it's ours now. So the good news is... Oof. Fitting memorial for a canine. Whoa! Okay, that was not expected. 
we've been doing so well. If you die in Minecraft, you're respawning your house, and the race is on to get your stuff back ASAP. Uh, it was only a matter of time, wasn't it? It was only a matter of time. It's not easy, as always, with this game. My ambition outstripped my ability in no small order. We went somewhere we really shouldn't have been. Was it here? Anyone watching? Give me some pointers. I think... I think it was here. I was on my little journey. Oh my goodness, tell me where. There, thank goodness. Okay, let's get our stuff back. I'm going to punch that spider to death. Because it's the only weapon we've... We weapon... Those that can speak, let me know. Let's hoover up some of our uh, remaining XP. Level 7. Hurt us pretty bad, didn't it, that? Um, but it's okay. These things happen in Minecraft, okay? These things happen. It's how you get over them and adjust. Unlucky, cave spiders are more powerful than normal ones. Oh, I've got even more stuff down here. Carrot I never knew I had. Uh... Yeah, well, there's a lesson. So, we've managed to pretty much safely turn that into what we hope is going to be uh, probably more successful than the mine we've got, but maybe we can join them up. I did see a flash of light, though. Whoa, where? Skeleton. You know what's happened, though, don't you, gamers? We've not re-equipped any of our stuff. So, quick move. We only had the... No. We can't die again. We're not going to let this happen. Gawain! For Wayne, we did it. <sighs> Didn't think we were going to for a minute, but we did. Okay. Let's uh, slap those down. Very amateuristic of us. Bravo Rogers, hello there. Hope you're well. Um, thanks for joining us. Okay, let's pop that there. Out we get. Now we need to go back and consolidate. We need a stone pickaxe so we can extract that iron ore. I'm tempted to go and explore all the way through to daylight again, but you know, it's a bit scary, very scary in fact. But we jump, like I say, if you're just joining us. Um, don't forget the older episodes are on our channel. If you hit like and subscribe, you've probably made my day. Doesn't take much, admittedly, but you know, spread the word around everybody. Say, hey, there's this really amateuristic guy playing Minecraft. It's worth a giggle, check it out. Uh, now we pop, his dog died, things got a little bit crazy, he died, things got a little bit crazy, bitten by a spider, poisonous one might add, very poisonous, so we'll hop back, we'll make a stone pickaxe, we're leveling up pretty good here gamers, uh, what do we need, we need sticks, to make sticks we need wood, okay, back in the Crafting table. There we go. Stone pickaxe a go go. We'll make a few of them. Oh my goodness. Now, everyone who's watching, this is a this is a currently in Wayne. <laughs> For Wayne, I need an unofficial controller podcast issue. Well things just leveled up gamers. Out of nowhere. We move to resettle in Wayne Wood. And this is all live. This is all live. Out of nowhere came a dog to our side, a wolf. Now you need bones to tame a wolf. And what you do is you look at him, L2 to tame. He immediately sit, stand, sit, stand. He immediately fell in love with us. This is something special. Oh my goodness gracious me. I don't think I've ever been happier. Let's get a picture of that. The moment, the iconic moment. Wow. Now, let's get some voting going on in the chat. What is this fella's name going to be? 
Oh, wow. You see, I'm very tempted to beckon him inside. Very tempted to beckon him inside. I nearly called him the name I shouldn't call him there. Uh, sit and never let him leave. That way he's safe, but it feels a little bit kidnappy. And uh, look at him. Well, I want to go on adventures with you. Yeah, but you might die. I couldn't live with myself if this happened. Um, let's have a look at some of these names because the chat on the big screen stopped. Dog, Wilfred, it's got to be Ray. Um, call him Dog. No matter how many times you type Dog, Rachel Hill, that still only counts as one vote. But there you go. So, look at him looking at me, looking at him, looking at him. Look at him looking at me, looking at him, looking at him. Wow, okay, well, the moment where it happened. Let's pop that there. Wayne's cousin found his way to the story. Are you gonna come with us? Uh, Dwayne, that was Daddy's other middle name from memory. Mark Garage Dot Gamers wanted to call him Tom. It's much more wants his name to be Arthur. Matty said, "Call him Dougie Mc Doggy McBain." <laughs> nice comment from Doogie there, Doggy McBain. Well, let's muse on it. Let's let a name for now. We'll just call him our faithful hound. Is it night time? The sun is setting. Okay, well, let's get in. You just sit there for a minute, fella. Yeah. Minecraft on hard. Survival is not an easy game. I don't care who you are. Keeping a dog alive in the process is very tough. Uh, maybe we will, Retro Gamer Thomas, have a Fort Wayne t-shirt. The battle cry of the hardened Minecrafter. We have got some t-shirts and merch if you want to, uh, if you listen to the podcast, if you don't, fair enough. It's, um, it's about games, new games, always safe for work, so it was first created, so if you've got kids and you listen to podcasts in the car, most um, podcasts have got swears, so you have to turn them off, so you can't listen to your favourite game in news when you've got the kids around. There you go, there's the memorial. It all happened after we built the proper memorial to the dog. He then, you just simmer down a little bit, will you? I don't think we've got any food for him. We need to check what we've got in stock because keeping this animal alive, let's get the food cooking. This is important, let's take the chicken out. Let's put another fuel source in there. Sit. I'm so happy we've got a new animal. Um, so this episode was entitled, making your house that little bit more homely. We've got some art, albeit Probably slightly larger than all the light, but there you go. What happens if we crouch and place the uh, painting? Where is it? Just picked it up. There it is. No, it's still huge. That's obscene. That's more of what I was going for. But that's not what we want. Look out, Wayne. Ooh, that'll give you night terrors, right above your bed. No one wants that, do they? Wake up, spider there. Uh, what happens if we put it next to the pillager? A man on a trike. I think it's a man on a trike. No one actually knows. The name for Oscar. Uh, lol, I love that. Doggy McBain is amazing. If you're not going to call him Dog, call him Oscar from Oscar. Good call, Matty. So, so far, we seem to be moving towards Doggy McBain. Looks like some of our armour's taken an absolute kicking, gamers. So we will go back and finish off the advanced mining techniques we were learning today. Do I take the dog down the mine? Oof. I'm not sure. Sit, stand. Good dog. Let's make sure we've got plenty of meat. That might be a thing we can do. This one might last less time than, the, than Wayne, but that's all... Can we burn these steps now we don't need them anymore? Let's have a little look-see. I did not want to do that. Because I'm crouched. 
crouch allows you to uh, attach things. Let's see if we can. Just burn those steps. Why not? Uh, let's go pick some Millie Berries, Wayne. I think it's okay. We can do that. A monument to an according, Wayne. According, Wayne. Forgive me. Forgive me, hound. Faithful hound. If you, you have yet to be named. You just don't do that. That is not something you do. The grown-ups listening, they've probably all done that. Uh, probably all done that. Okay, up we go. This is a safe job for a dog, isn't it? Tell you what we, are, what we might also do. Pick, 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 pick. You can't get hit by these because they do take life. They grow back very quickly, don't they? So we start off with a hearty breakfast of berries. Faithful hound, come away. Hashtag still hurts. Yeah, I don't think we're fully over it, but you know, we've got a new pet in our lives. Couldn't get any better, could it? Uh, okay, down, down, down. So one thing that we could do, uh, I think this is important, we'll quickly We'll quickly punch the living wits out of this dirt to create a terrace. For those listening, it's a two hour stream. We're 46 minutes in. Um, and it's a, a fun little let's play where we learn some lessons in Minecraft while also having a laugh while we do it, hopefully. Where is he? You sit there, you cannot afford run the risk if you we've got seeds now, I saw a chicken those uh, mindful viewers and gamers will know that you can attract I do believe with seeds chickens uh, and from there we should start to be able to be a little bit more sustainable in our little playthrough we're just leveling off an area we're gonna make a chicken coop guarantee you now I won't be able to find even one chicken what was that? Oh, it was just a bit of silver birch. It looked to me like a pillager, but it's okay. We're past that moment now, and we survived it. Look at this. A little bit more dirt whacking. Everyone knows if you go outside, you want to dig a hole in the garden, just go outside, punch the dirt as hard as you can, and it will just eviscerate in front of your eyes. Very, very realistic as we keep going. You should adopt the Doggy McBain name to heal that wound. Uh, I'm feeling Doggy McBain. I'm feeling it. At the moment, that's probably the number one winner. Especially seeing as a toddler came up with it as well. Uh, so keep digging. Game Boy Matty, the actual name of the podcast. But uh, don't tell him that it's actually the unofficial controller podcast. I think he'll be devastated. Um, we keep digging, and we keep digging. So, if you want to keep chickens, you've got to put them, you've got to make a little pen for them. So we'll use our freshly made axe to go, come on Wayne, this, oh God. Okay, right, to get over the, the pain, Doggy McBain, come on Doggy. That's his new name. Should be able to help move forward from there. Keep calling him Wayne. Hopefully he'll forgive me for that because it is a pretty rude thing to do. Um, calling someone after your dead ex is pretty low rent as far as I'm concerned. Okay, there we go. Collected up the wood. Again, if you've just joined us, welcome. Thank you. If you feel that way inclined, if you click that little thumbs up button, oh yeah, that's... Uh, made me feel good thank you for that and if you click subscribe do what all the bigger boy youtubers do turn on the notifications whenever we go live with a new video that means that you will never miss a single moment of ours and doggy mcbain's adventure through minecraft you get through there doggy see now i've actually given him a name something solid he can get behind uh, i don't think i'll call him the wrong name again which is a relief for all of us, especially those those of us that are still mourning the loss of Wayne. Doggy McBain it is. 
Okay, there we go. Doggy McVeigh. He's got a last name as well, so he's, he's got a little bit more pedigree and heritage. This one smells of iron brew when it gets wet. Wayne smelled of lavender when he got sit. When he got uh, when he got wet, this one smells of iron brew. Okay. Uh, keep going in here. I shouldn't because this is my tool area out here. Let's make it slightly larger. Let's go in here. So now we've got the. Let's make planks. Let's also make sticks. Why can't we make sticks? Why is this game doing this to me? We don't need to. Let's get as many of those as we can. Look at there they are. There's the sticks. We'll just quickly for the PC gamers watching to make a fence panel. You need two planks separated by two sticks. Four planks in total. Um, we've run out. What do we need to make? More of these. Probably need to make more of these. There we go. Um, Doggy Mc Doggy McWayne. Oof. Doggy McWayne. Okay. Okay. That's probably what we'll go with. I'll probably slip up a couple of times, but just just work with me. Uh, where are we? Let's make some more planks and some more sticks, and that will enable us to make some more fences. I want this to be quite a nice chicken coop. I don't want it to be like a battery pen. That would be pretty mean. Uh, where are we going to put it? We've cleared all this space and now we're spoiled for choice. So let's put the... No. Let's put that there. We can fence this area in. I said I didn't want it to be too small, but I don't want it to be too big either. Uh, there we go. There we go. Well, that escalated quickly, didn't it, Wait, uh, Nearly. Doggy McQueen. That escalated very quickly. We're out of sticks and stones already. More of these. There we go, 15. That should be plenty. So when we get up in the morning, we can have Millie, Millie Berries, and we can have a fine... Have I overreached myself? probably, uh, and a fine breakfast of egg, which later on we can give you some top tips about how to make recipes. Right, now we select the gate, and we, that's right doggy, let's go inside. Are you following? You are in follow mode, and your tail is up, all is good. Come on doggy. There we go. Shut that door. You can sit. Oh, see in there? Like a dog on a shiny floor. Doggy McWayne. So that's where we're at. Sleep. So tomorrow morning, in game, we're going to get ourselves some chickens. One or two. Uh, we need to make sure we've got some seeds. There we have. Seeds. Perfect. Okay. This feels like a safe adventure for you, Doggy McWayne. Let's go. Let's find ourselves a chicken. Ooh, ooh, God, no, 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 no. Oh! How dangerous it is. The adrenaline. Let's collect these up. Did it damage the fence? No, it survived. That would have been very cruel if it had died. After all that work we put into it yesterday. But that's Minecraft for you. It's a skeleton there surviving in the shadows. It's not a cool look, but it's survivable. There we go. Don't fall down there. Do not fall down there. So we've covered up the battle damage. We ought to get some food, because I couldn't live with myself if Doggy McWayne perished. Uh, what did we have? We've got chicken, fantastic. Let's take some uh, cooked beef, some raw beef. Yeah, we did go on a, my war axe. 
that's what we're going to use. Let's clip the fresh. This is going to go. It's going to go bad. If this is a, a recipe for how the day is going to go. Get him, doggy. Nice work. Nice work. You're earning your keep. I like it. Savage, savage animal. Let's give him some food quickly. I think we can give him raw beef. Again, much like his forebear. Oh, he did get very wounded, didn't he? You're going to eat my stash now. Uh, how it goes. Love, happy, go. A, sheep, a chicken. We didn't have to go far, did we? So now to tame a chicken, what you've got to do is you've got to get its eyes, got to get it, get its attention. Again, it's not an easy game. There, you see, when you've got the seeds, look at him, look at you. Seeds, looking at us. Right, let's go. Let's trick him back. You careful up there, doggy. Careful. Look at that. Look at that. Let's tempt him back. Make sure you've got your path clear. You're all right, chicken. Come on. Names in the chat for the chicken. Come on. Come on, herd him up. He's obviously got an element of sheepdog in him. Come on, chicken. Get him in here, Wayne. That's it. Deselect. Not looking at you anymore. That's how it gets done. Right, now, he will lay eggs. Let's feed him a little bit. We feed him from here? Feed. He's in love as well. Okay. Now, just to go into a little bit of detail, when you get two animals with the, with the hearts above them, they will go off to a corner and then... Minecraft magic happens and a baby appears. Chickens also lay eggs. Those that have been listening and watching since episode zero, they know that there's a one in four chance, I believe, for a thrown egg to become a chicken, which we'll try. Uh, let's see if we can find another one then. I'm feeling racy. Come on, doggy. McWayne is from the McWayne clan. We'll see his famous forebear. What we got here for names? Chicken Nugget or Mr. Cluckers? Oh, Chicken Nugget. Well, I'll tell you what, there's the names. Mr. Cluckers is the first one, and the second one's gonna be called Chicken Nugget. I think Chicken Nugget's gonna have to be the female, and Mr. Cluckers is gonna be the male version. They all look the same. There's no cockerels in this game. They all look the same. One day we're going to have a very burgeoning farm. We'll have pigs, we'll have cows. In the meantime, though, there's nothing but butchery. What we need his meat. Keep out. He's got a bloodlust in him, doggy McWayne. He's not scared, is he? He'll have a nibble. I tell you what, that. Uh, is it this way? That cross is working for us, isn't it? That can be seen from at least two yards away. Uh, we'll keep going though, we'll press on, we'll hack at some grass to see if we can find some more seeds. Because that's how seeds come, there you go. What have we got down here? Ooh. You see water fill it in. It's not deep enough, but I'm not prepared to run the risk anymore. I'm just not. Not after last time, doggy. Not after last time. Uh, well, we're going to have more than one chicken in the chat, so the good news is... We can have multiple. Oh, get back. Get back, doggy! Don't you dare. Don't you dare. You've got some sort of a death wish on you. Uh, getting quite far away from home. Quite far away. What's that? Come on. We don't need the battle cry. It doesn't look like we're going to have to go into into battle. We don't need to shout for Wayne. But the Gasloff Games flowers signify, signify, well, I can't even say it, signifying something of interest over here. So let's climb this little hillock and find out what that was. I saw a flappy thing. Was it a bee? Oh my goodness. I think it is. Bees. 
Wild bees. Look at them. Isn't that beautiful? Pollinating the flowers here. Sit and have a moment here. Isn't that beautiful? What do you reckon, Wayne? Oh, God. Maybe I should just kill this animal because I'm obviously blatantly not over the former, his former... Uh, I'm sorry. How can I make it up to you? Hey, What is it I can do to make it up to you, Doggy McWayne? Uh, I know one quick way to an animal's heart. It's food. Doggy McWayne. Oh, don't be like that. What if... Come on. Please. He loves me, doesn't he? He forgive me in the end. Couldn't look at me to start with. He was angry and furious, and I don't blame him. Um, okay, now I've done the thing that you shouldn't do in Minecraft. I've got myself well and truly lost. I think we crossed here. The Gaslops Games flowers signifying this is the way home. Uh, where is he? He's well happy, isn't he? His life hasn't been this good since he was adopted from being a stray. Let's go. Jumpity jump jump. Come on, doggy. It's a very simple name. Uh, Rachel just killed a witch. Oh, well done. Uh, pro gamer. Doogie's thinking it's changed so much. Minecraft's changed so much since he last played it. You don't know the half of it. You don't know the half of it. Right. Uh, I'm getting a little bit nervous now. Where's home? Where's home? Don't tell me we've lost another house. On a quest for a chicken. We've got, we've got, we've got commitments now. We've got wild animals alive at our homestead. We can't just abandon them. What was that? It's hunger. Luckily I've got a chicken I can chew on. to get home now doggy we need to get home uh, must be this way gotta be this way if not we'll have to pillar up and see if we can find the cross that we built visible from oh we're home look at that the minecraft gods shine upon us they do don't they they do chimney working nicely <laughs> Welcome back to the homestead. You be careful down there, doggy. You just be careful, Sunbeam. We don't want to see you in pain. Oh, and we've got a trader here as well. So, there's a, where is he? He's there. Now, we haven't got enough life. Just He's having a swim. You be careful. You, uh, McWayne's aren't famed for your ability in water. That's an absolute fact. You just get out. He's looking at us, the chicken's looking, he's keen. He's thinking, yes, I can spend the rest of my life in servitude with you. That's something I can do, so let's do it. We'll look after you, we'll feed you occasionally. Let's see if he's still following. He is, come on. You sit, Wayne, you just, uh, doggy. It's never, sorry. Well, I don't know what I can do to make you forgive me. Feed you and feed you. Look at this. This is how babies happen. Fact. There you go. So, oh, brilliant. No, no, no. What's wrong with these animals? They made a bid for freedom, didn't they? What I need very quickly is to get some seeds Oh dear, that did not go to plan. We spend all day finding one, we get two, we get three, and then we end up with none. This is not good, not good at all. I'm a little bit disturbed. Do we have some? Yes, one seed, it'll do. It's dark as well, it's dangerous. We're running the risk, so are they. They move quick, don't they? Right, get here, get here. Look, I have seeds. Come on, 
What are you doing? Get down. Get down from there. Now, we, listen. This is obviously Mr. Cluckers. He's a very naughty hen. Uh, come on. Gate discipline. We were lacking the gate discipline and it got out. Come on, what's wrong with you? Hurry up. Hurry up. Come on. Like a real chicken does a lot of flapping around. Does not a lot of else. Right, in we come. Right, get in here. Right, now. That's the skeleton. Stay there. We're going to go to bed. Your son, I'm not bothered. Oh, God. I'm sorry. I just egged Doggy McWayne. Rather brutal of me. I'm sorry. Come on inside now. I apologise to you for what I did. I'm sorry. Sit. Right. Maybe tomorrow we can find ourselves another... Another hen. I've got the seeds. Right, you just... Okay, whatever you want to do. You're in charge now, Doggy McWayne. You're pulling the strings, much like the podcast. Tom's in charge. Right. Where is it? It got it knew, didn't it? It sniffed its freedom and it just legged it. That's the sound of a skeleton with a death wish. Yeah, hit me now. Oh God. My life is lower than it should be. I need to probably run away, live to fight another. We're not doing very well this episode, are we? Not very well at all. I need your help, Wayne. Uh, doggy, I need your help. Well, let's go back down here. Let's find our... It wasn't that far away either, was it? Ah, yes, that's what you get. That's what you deserve. Burn. Burn. Nice finishing touch from Doggy McWayne. Ultimately, all we want is some seeds. We've got quite a lot of stuff here now. All we want is a chicken. It's not that much to ask, really, is it? But the ever-expanding homestead... The ever-expanding homestead... Lay an egg! Lay an egg! I don't speak to all animals like that, doggy. Just the naughty ones. So, once again, let's have a... There they are! As if by magic they thought they'd got away from us, but they... Yeah, you can run. You can run. This is life on... Yeah, the chick knows. You see, it saw me first. It immediately bonded with me as its parent. Its eyes clasped on mine. First thing. Right. You can both come back. Come on now. You following? Yes! Mr. Clucker's chicken nugget, whatever you guys decided the baby was going to be called. It's on you. Right, no. Right, let's, are they here? Nice work shepherding. Come on. They've got the attention span of smaller than mine. Come on then. This way. Come on, bring him in, Wayne. Come on, come by. Come by, Wayne. Come by. There we go. There we go, nice work. As a team, everybody in here. And you, Mr. Cluckers. Deselect, they're not, oh no. Stay with your parents. Oh, look at them. These animals, they do not want to get, get in here, get in here. Get in here, in here, here, here. Stay, stay. Stay, stay, deselect, gate shut, yes, <clears throat> they're in, one man is McWayne, there you go, where is McWayne, we were too busy, there he is, good work fella, good work, let's see if we can get, let's feed the small chick, there we go, green means growing, fantastic work, so I guess, now we've got ourselves a little bit of sustainability going on. I keep picking these berries and forgetting to eat them. 
but it's all right here. It's okay. We've got them. Top of this uh, small ridge is where we found a massive grove of Millie berries growing. Uh, the chicks just look like uh, just look like you're not all there. Yeah, they do look at me a little bit like that. I mean, it, it, it's a it's a look I get quite a lot of the time. Uh, that look of sort of is this guy for real? I don't even know. There we go. Right, we've got a hearty breakfast. We've got ourselves a small homestead developing. I'm a little bit nervous, Swain, about taking you down to the other mine, just because there was lots of stabby things down there. Call him the wrong name again, Doggy. Come on, Doggy. Let's make this a proper entrance. We can't. Yes, we can. There's enough spare blocks to make that a step. There we go. Let's see if we can, on our own doorstep, get some materials. Do we have any torches left? No, we didn't. So another lesson, gamers. We're going to show you how to sustainably make charcoal if you haven't got access to... In fact, you know what? I might regret this, doggy. I might regret this, but let's go to that other mine because there was an abundance of materials just waiting there for us. There really was. Payne's dead. Hello, welcome to the chat. Uh, the chickens look so cute the way they look at you. Yes, they do, don't they? And the smaller ones, even more so. You should plant some of the berry bushes outside your house, in the garden, maybe. That's a good idea. Once again, very sustainable thinking from you. Quite like the fact they're on top of this hill, though. We come up for a part of our morning ritual. I've probably got more berries than I know what to do with now. Okay, listen, doggy. You just be careful because this is a very dangerous area. Was this the mine? No, that wasn't the mine. Where was the mine? Here it is. Yeah, some bad memories here. Not as bad as the ones that we've got in the other mine. Come on. Come on, doggy. I think we can leave you here. Sit. You can't sit quick enough like a real good dog, can he? Welcome to the chat, Payne's Dead. Thank you for joining us. Right. Now, we made the steps before we got mercilessly killed by those cave spiders. I think we can harvest this here. Of course we can. Stone pickaxe. Get in the iron ore, which we can smelt to make ourselves some more advanced mining tools. There we go. We also came down here looking for coal. No, I could have, there we go. Could have sworn I saw some. And that glint noise was the sound of XP. Oh my goodness. I'm guessing that was a creeper. Oof. Talk about a jump scare, gamers. That scared the living daylights out of me. Why can't we pick that up? Oh, we've got full inventory. Let's uh, take the glass, throw it on the floor, collect ourselves up that... Uh, I just saw daylight here and I'm just intrigued to see where it comes out in relation to our house. Because something tells me it should be pretty close. I haven't forgotten about the dog. Don't worry. I haven't forgotten about the doggy. Uh, Mark Garage Games is off now. Glad you found another hound. Be safe. Thank you, Mark.Garage.Gamers. Uh, just another 45 minutes left of uh, gaming action. So stick close. Hold tight. Hopefully you've uh, got some patience and a little bit... Right. There's enough of that. They've got the height advantage now, but I've got the moves. Get back. Get back. <sighs> Another close call. But we survived it. Level five. We're someone. We're getting there. A lot of, a lot of iron ore to be found here today. Any more coal? Yes. I thought I saw some. Let's get that. A little bit more. 
and we can create torches, we can power up that furnace that we've got back at home, and ourselves a nice rich seam here. Let's dig deep into that. It's times like this when I feel like a real miner. This is a mighty big seam of coal. Look at this. And it goes down. It's these moments in Minecraft. So realistic. Look at this. So now you get coal for your fire at home. Comes out this easy. Don't know what the miners are all moaning about. Uh, everyone's saying bye to mark.garage.gamers in the chat. His parents knew what to name him when they named him. His name predates the internet, but they had the foresight to uh, call him a name that can be very quickly internetized. Wonderful stuff. Here we go. There we go. Dropping like rain, isn't it? We'll take it. This is helping us XP up as well, so we can maybe get back to the lofty heights of the level 12 we've got to. Tell you what, this pickaxe has got some reach, hasn't it? Hey, okay, stand at the bottom of your garden. Do we take that? We take that? We greedy? Yeah, we're greedy. And that. Now we can go. There's another little lesson to those that have joined us today for the first time. Maybe we haven't got the attention span to go back and watch the other episodes. We can make possibly uh, an iron sword and also such a good boy. What have I got for you? In deference to myself, doggy. Love you too. Right, get up. Let's go. Oh, it's getting dark. We better hurry. Uh, quick as you can now, Doggy McWayne. Quick as you can now. Let's get back before the night terrors come. Which I think is going to be soon, so we need to move. I oh, know, I love you too, Doggy. Uh, let's just get this. Let's get all this out of the way. Let's get all this foliage. Some midnight millyberries. I'll take them. Yes, I will. Ooh, 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 ooh. Look at the fear in our eyes. Come on, doggy. Oh, no. Oof. What are you looking at? What are you looking at? I was looking for you. You were looking for me. Fantastic. Right, let's go. Doggy McWayne's certainly got a little bit more character about him. Uh, I heard that. Did you hear that? Get in. Oh, where is he? He's fighting, he's seeing off. No, I can't afford for you to do this. He did it though. He did it. Right, you can get inside now, doggo. You've done enough for today. What's wrong with you? Come on. It's not safe out here. Like, well done for seeing off the bad man. But at the same token, look at the realism here. Look at that. The same token, doggy. Get in. Where are you getting? He senses danger. I don't know what it is. Come on. Come on inside. Come on. You can have the bed. If you want it, you can have it. Take it. Come on. What's wrong with him? He's not happy, is he? Don't know what's wrong with the dog, but let's see if we can find out. What about some chicken? Chicken? You coming? Come on. Okay. He's at it. He's at it. He has eaten it. Come on. What's wrong with you, animal? He don't want to come in. Fair play. Fine. If I care, doggy, I'll sleep on the bed. Got the bed to myself. Steve, you're absolutely right. Put your nine pant on my guy. Okay. He, he is a savage. Where is he? There he is. Oh, now you're all spring chickens. How are the chickens doing? There's an egg. He needs to get the egg. I've got to go in. No, no. 
Did it leave? I'm fed up with you, Mr. Cluckers. Every day, the same scenario. Yes! First baby. Born fresh from an egg. Oh, Mr. Cluckers has laid an egg. Interesting. Okay. No. Let's pick that up. Let's see if we can get some seeds. This, uh, I tell you what, the rate at which this um, chicken farm is growing is pretty exciting stuff. Okay, where are we? Give me some seeds. How am I meant to tame a chicken without seeds? What have we got? There's some. Hallelujah. It's in the quick menu. I agree, doggy. Right, where did that chicken go? Anyone see? There he is. Oh, you want now? You want food? Now, you've got, now I've got food. You're all ears. Right, come on. In you come. Wayne, get out. No, what's wrong with that? You're not a dog. You're a chicken. Come in with your kind. Come in with your kind. Okay. They're not into iron. Oh, you are kidding me. Some sort of bizarre comedy show. Get in here. All of you over here. What we're going to do. Can you. Are you. You haven't even got the brains you were born with, Mr. Cluckers. Now, come on. Here we go. There we go. Right. Gate closed. Select some iron ore, because they're not going to eat that. He's gagging to get out, isn't he? You're not getting out. There we go. Oh, it shouldn't be that difficult, should it? It should not be that difficult. Build him a kennel for outside. Maybe we should. Uh, remember Wayne, eh, Mr. Doggo? You, you know... You're slightly more disobedient than he was. I'll give you that. You're slightly more disobedient than he was. You can sit. I need to eat. Because I believe we've got a lot of these sweet berries, gamers. A lot of these sweet berries. Eat. 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 Do you know what I saw over the, over the ridge? I saw... I wonder if I can sneak through these trees. Did he say, where is he? He's there, good, okay. I saw a creeper, maybe you did too. Where is he? He's gonna out stealth me. Thing about creepers is they're green. Thing about Minecraft is it's green. It means they're very hard to spot. Probably just hear a kaboom out the corner of my ear any second now, and it'll be game over. Probably drawn him, lured him. There he is. No, you do not. Can we get an arrow on him? Yes. One top tip. If you're using the bow and arrow, and then you don't want to shoot, you just quickly, in your quick menu, switch to another weapon and you're not going to waste an arrow. Because at the moment they're a terribly finite resource. We've got 10 left. Uh, all good on the health. I'll eat one more of these berries. There we go. So we've got some chickens. We've got some fine resource here now. So within there, we can fire that up with a little bit of coal. In fact, we've got the steps, we don't need to. Um, so we'll use the, where is it? Iron ore. Now we can start making some iron ingots. And from there, we can start smithing ourselves because I think this whole experience has took its toll, not only on our physical form, but uh, on our armor as well. So let's put all that back on, put the shield in our hand. There we go. Not looking too ropey, I don't think. What do you think, Doggo? What do you think to the new suit? You like it? You've seen better. 
Well, you know, it was off the shelf number, it wasn't tailored. Um, build a bigger pen with doors indoors. I think you're right. I think, Stephen, you are absolutely right. We need to build ourselves a gate within a gate so we can have like a double gated scenario. Something I've done before, it's something that I think needs to be done again. There we go. Now we need to just quickly jump up here to our workshop, make another gate. Top tip, gamers. There we go, almost like an airlock system. Nothing gets in, nothing gets out. Unless one of these crazy ass animals gets in here with me. They wouldn't be that foolish. There we go. What do you reckon to that, doggy? Hey, you proud of me? Thank you to Stephen in the chat for that idea. Absolutely cracking. Uh, good. Good animal. I love you, doggy. Uh, I know. We're having a good day, aren't we, on the ranch? All a waste of an egg, but you never know. One in four chance it hatches a chick. Um, what we ought to do is we ought to maybe just clear some more grass down. See if more seeds? Got. Got them. If we uh, cut some more grass. There we go. Keep hacking away at the grass. Every now and then, it's going to spawn some seeds. What, what, what was that, doggy? Oh my goodness gracious me. I'm not saying that we can get lax if we've got two animals. You just, just gently approach. There we go. There we go. There we go. Don't move. Sit, stand, sit, stand. Oh my goodness. Doggy. I know, bark, cheer. I want you to meet. Come over here, doggy. Oh, he's shy. They're both bashful, look, it's like blind date. They're waiting for the curtain to come down. But they, look. Doggy, doggy. Need to remember who's who now. It's gonna get very confusing. Call it rough. Oh, oh my goodness. And Wayne's tears descend from the sky. Let's go, hounds. Meet your new, meet your new girlfriend, doggy. Did I make it sit? Where are they both? Here they are. Wonderful. A never-ending supply of hounds. This is partially good news. Let's see if we can. Uh, obviously, with hounds comes great responsibility. Um, and if we can, I don't know who's who in here anymore, but maybe mum and son, mum and daughter, but either which way, there we go. Chips everywhere. He doesn't want to eat. They're not in the mood for love anymore. That's fine. Oh. Wayne's girl, uh, doggy's girlfriend shivering. Well, maybe you should come inside. Come on. So what we're calling the new one? Um, call the Range Farmerton. I think that's a great idea. Well, where is... You can sit and you can sit. Teeny top and tiny. There you go. All sat very well. Uh, 17 iron ingots. From there, we'll make an iron sword. Quickly go outside to the work shed, to the work area underneath. Uh, where are we? Iron sword. Yes. Shears. Yes, because we're going to do something else as well, gamers. Uh, it's not Halloween. I think on our journey last time we did. We found pumpkin. Uh, this is something for the younger viewers. A little bit of fun that we can use. Do you believe? If we, oh, where are we going to put it? I know where we can put it. 
that torch now. Not gonna let us, is it? Sorry guys. It's good while it lasted, friend. Uh, we'll pop that there. No, we can't do it to him. I won't sleep tonight. Minecraft or real, if we did that. So let's uh, pop that there, and we'll use the shears on the uh, pumpkin. Get ready for this, viewers. Oh, what am I doing wrong? Maybe someone let me know in the chat. I always thought they snipped. And you could make jack-o'-lanterns. I'll have to research that. Maybe Millie can let me know. <sighs> thought it was at the time. No, it's not what we want. I think you guys know what I'm trying to work towards. Working towards a jack o' lantern. Um, no. There we go. I had to crouch, didn't I? Perfect. Look at that. And now. No, that's not quite what we want. I'm sure we'll get there. I heard a dead thing. You don't go inside. It's night time. Probably invoked it, was such a freaky, but they're meant to keep bad things away. That's the story of uh, can't rest now, monsters nearby. Ooh. No, 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 it doesn't end like this. Not like this. See him breaking the door down. Anybody? Rough? Dugan McWayne. Craft it in the crafting table to make it light up. Let's do that. I don't know if this is going to make it explode. Probably not. Got away with it. There is the... I wonder if we can... Uh... If it's... There we go. Boom. Pumpkin plus a torch. That's how they do it out of light. Uh, pop that there. Where are we going to put that, gamers? Where are we going to put that? Let's pop it here. Done. Oh my god. We're just absolutely lost and consumed with our own invincibility right now. I'm punching him with my own hands. No, I'm not bothered. Why can't I act? Come on, perish. Oof, that was close. Uh, that was very, very close. Um, right. These animals seem very happy, don't they? Well, I don't know if it's going to be more dog than we can handle, because we've only got a small abode. Let's see if we can uh, feed. Oh, slightly hungrier than I gave him credit for. Uh, that's fine. That's all fine. Let's have one of those... Beautiful, beautiful moments in game. My God, that animal was absolutely vanished, wasn't it? Uh, maybe it's because it sat down. But I did expect to see. Right, get up. And you, stand. Oh, goodness. I'm sorry. What's wrong with you? Wait. There we go. It's all right, I was pressing the wrong button. That dot was very close to death. I hate to say it, we weren't taking good care of our pets. And that, how wounded was this animal? It's got a, just a hole in its stomach that's gonna take some filling. Looks like a magnificent lantern. Yeah, I thought it was quite cool too. Okay, this is how we start the day. Let's go outside. We've got 35 mini berries. We probably don't need to go on the train. Let's collect the eggs. It's that time of the day. Close. Open. Shouldn't have planted that there. Uh, I think 
Get back, get back, get back. The airlock system working like an absolute treat. Uh, place, place, place. Got our own supply. Right, he's gonna get it, you know. Ruff and Doggy McWayne. The problem is now, I'm a little bit confused about who's who because they've bizarrely both got the same collars. They've got a little bit mixed up, but we'll we'll work with it. We will work with it. So this episode, have we done what we said we were going to do? Advanced mining, kind of. We've made our house look a little bit better. We've got a chimney, a working one, mind you. We've got a jack-o'-lantern. That's something. We've got a very bizarre picture of what the chap decided was Pinocchio um, on a unicycle. We've killed a pillager, we initiated a raid. Um, we've got some iron. Let's ditch the things we don't need. Millie's right, we could dye the collar, which we will get round to doing. Uh, let's leave the eggs, we need those. We've got pumpkin seeds. We've got Nathan and Ronan. We've got Max, Charlie and Oliver. Uh, with Max being the Minecraft master, could teach us all a thing or two, me especially. In Minecraft, we've got Game Boy Matty, Young Daniel Ridge, Alex and Anna, and Kane Newby. And all is good in the wood. Right, I've got myself a little bit disorientated, uh, doggies. Once again, the... <laughs> get him! No. I'm starting to get a little bit fearful about how damaged these animals are getting. Let's get them back home. Come on. Because nothing's worth this. We've seen... Uh, sorry I've got to go, but a great stream. Millie, thank you for joining us. Um, well, it'll always be here to see retrospectively. There's just 20 minutes left, so hopefully nothing too bad happens. Did he eat that? Feed. Good. Okay. Both tails looking good. To anyone wanting to know, the tails up or down signify the life uh, levels of the animals. You can actually, you guys can stay here just for this. Um, because next to the chickens, to keep these chickens. Oh, I managed to grab that through the fence. One in four chance, two shots, didn't get it. Not to worry. Um, here's the little mini berry area. Hmm, they would go there, wouldn't they? We've got them. Okay, so to keep the chicken sustained, we need some um, rapidly growing. We're going to have to do it down here this time, gamers, because we haven't got a bucket. We need a bucket. Um, oh, no. They are having a moment together, so we'll leave them to it. We can make a bucket. Now, again, for the PC players, three... Bits of iron ingot in the shape of a bucket will make a bucket. Now you can go down to any water source or lava or milk and we'll get there with the cows, I'm sure we will. Um, collect. Look at that. Bucket full of water. Simple as that. Now because I like my farm to be neat, I don't like to grow everything down at the water's edge all the time. Not very realistic, is it, to a boy like me? Um, so, I've got some dirt. Let's pop that there. Let's enlarge the plateau a little bit because water will wet so many blocks. To the older gamers, it's just a little bit like. Um, well, if you're still here, Millie, thank you for joining us again. Like I said, um, if you haven't liked and subscribed, what's wrong with you? Um, the ongoing saga. Wayne of, uh, well, it's no longer Wayne, rest his soul, but me, my two animals, Ruff and Doggy McWayne, uh, the continuing saga of our life in Minecraft, also hopefully teaching you a little bit about the basics of how to thrive and survive. I tell you what, if we could get a chicken farm and a uh, hen house, I think we'll be doing really well for ourselves. Where should we put the small? Let's put it here. Small.
crop seeds that we've managed to gather. There, there, there. We're out of earth. We're out of dirt. It's fine. We'll quickly grab ourselves. I think we've got enough wood in stock. And we don't, but we can quickly make some planks. And from there, we can quickly make some sticks. From there, we can quickly make a wooden hoe. Do you need this to prepare the... Okay, right. I said I wasn't going to do anything crazy. This guy is going to have to die. Now, I wouldn't normally advocate violence, but the thing is, when he dies, he drops leashes. And it's one of the best ways to get them. Now, the llamas are going to be a bit upset for a while because I robbed them of their owner and they will spit quite violently towards me. And it does cause damage, as you saw. But I'm not going to take them down. I'm just going to let them go free. There you go. See, if you've got emeralds, you can trade with those guys. Till, LT. Never forget that. Uh, so we'll make it like this. So all the seasoned veterans, you know about uh, how soil works in such games as Harvest Moon. We'll quickly dig that, put water in there. That will wet these areas down. See it happen? You did see it happen there. I'm not just making this up. It's a true story. And then we can plant get that dirt block out. We can plant the seeds. And the good news is these will grow into wheat. That's all we've got. But the thing is this is self-sustaining. This will grow, turn into wheat, which we can harvest for seeds. Uh, and it will help us further our cause in the game because we'll be able to create more. Off they go. The llamas, they're happy with their newfound freedom. I keep freezing. Well, I'm sorry for that. It's probably because I live in the middle of nowhere um, and the internet's not that great. But let's get the let's get the dogs out. Here they are. Up you get. This way. Doggy McWayne. That's not something I can shout in a rush, is it? We'll just call him Doggy and Rough. That's their names. I don't know which one's the female. I'm a bit confused. So are they. But that's okay. Up you get. There you go. A little bit of breakfast. Eat. Should we go on an adventure? Let's, because we've got this stick here, and we've got our leash just before we end the stream for today. I think it's about to, the sun's about to set, so that's, uh, where is it? Yes, it's past the yard arm. Let's run inside. You can only sleep at night. Okay. You can't both get in at once. It's like a Groucho Marx movie. You get one of these is gonna have to just give way. Then you can come in. Right now, come in. No, you don't want to come in. What's wrong with you? Right. Can I sleep yet? Yes. So just before we end the stream, uh, sounds like Rachel's died three times. She's having a play. It's how it goes. The game is pretty brutal. To be fair. Teaches you some life lessons though. Let's see if we can drag a sheep. We're gonna drag a pig back. That's what we're gonna do. So we've got our we've got our newfound leashes. Uh, our next episode will make this fella a uh, a forever home. You can run, but you can't hide. Put the leash on him. Now none of that shenanigans that we had. Don't hurt him. This is our new friend, Pork Chop. Yes. Come on, Pork Chop. I know, it's a bit of a brutal name, but just go with it. I don't want you hanging around. I set you free for a reason. Oh, the leash broke, but it's okay. Now what you can do with the leashes, goodness knows how Minecraft does the computing power for this. There we go. 
He's now tied up. Let's get rid of that. He's now tied up. Don't eat Wayne's flowers. Don't eat Wayne's memorial flowers, whatever you do. No. You just chill. Don't eat the pumpkin. Don't eat the pumpkin either. Um, I suppose we've got enough time to maybe make the beginnings of the... Uh, where's our axe? Where's our war axe gone? Is it broken? We'll make another one. We'll make an iron axe. I think we've got the materials. We have. Uh, there it is. Let's go chop down some more of this wonderful uh, woodland that we found this, you see, growing four blocks out. That's how it works. Maybe even five. So that's wet ground as well. I love it. Right. I love it. Okay. This is a mighty large specimen. Let's take that. We can make our pig pen with this. He's good. He talks to the animals. He talks to the animals. Doggy, rough. Finally getting the hang of your new names. Um, let's have this down as well. Realistic Maya tree chopping technique. This one's grown itself into a twisted and contorted shape. Isn't that fantastic? Dragon Ball editor, hey can I join? No, no. This is a this is a structured let's play tutorial. Um, but I'm sure there's plenty of people in the chat and around that you can join with. Uh, oh, we go. So, yeah, you're tied up, friend. What's wrong with this llama? Don't you dare. Don't you dare move in. I set you free. This can't be a sitcom. 2.4 llamas. No, it can't. Um, let's quickly make some planks. And from there, we can quickly make some sticks as well. And then that should allow us to create some more fence posts. Um, which we'll start with. I don't know where we're going to put Piggy. Uh, as much as this moment was special to me, uh, Doggy and Ruff. Do I knock that down? What do you think? Knock it down, yes or no? Do I knock this down? Come on, talk to me, doggy. Ruff, what do you think? I found you over there. But him, I found here. What do you think? Keep it, not keep it. He's going. We don't need it, we've got each other. We'll always remember that the pig pen is where, if anything ever happens to you, doggy, I'll knock the pig pen down and we'll put something in its uh, in its place. There we go. A little suggestion from the chat that I can ride the pig. I need a saddle for Now, that's PhD. And we're not in creative, so these saddles don't just fall from trees. Not like most of the things in Minecraft, these don't fall from trees. So we're just going to clear a little bit of space. I like the wooded area that we find ourselves in. Uh, let's take these down and out. I'm a little bit concerned about the ability for these animals to jump out. I'm not joking, it does happen. Um, so we're going to utilise, because the pig's probably going to enjoy living under a tree. Plenty of mud for him to get involved in. Uh, there, there, there. It's okay. Nothing's forever in Minecraft. So if we change our mind, we can change our mind. There, and there. Yeah, that'll do. Easy, easy, easy. Easy. Simmer down. Uh, wood planks. And then we can create. We're looking for an ability to make a gate. What am I missing? Probably sticks. He's always missing sticks, is that boy. That's what his teacher used to say. You'd do well if only had a few more sticks. Uh, great way to end. Let's just make sure we've got the gate. Birch fence. Oak fence. 
after, oh there it was, I've gone blind, oak fence, pop the other one down, not doing very well here gamers, uh, the pressure's getting to me, there we go, gate, now if you look at, when you've tied up an animal, oh that's not what I wanted to do, but anyway, come on, I know you're not that keen, but you've got a new home here now. In you come, through the gate. I'll unleash you if you come in. Oh, God. Oh, come on, piggy, now. Are you kidding me? You have to be kidding me. I said I'll unleash you if you play ball, but you didn't play ball, did you? So, I'm sorry. And we can certainly put, uh, we can make something a little bit more, get out, no, 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 oh, not this again, the comedy of errors, come on, oh, I know, in through the gate please, pork chop, right, no, pork chop, Pork chop, through the gate. You've been in once. Right, if I open this, you're coming in. Come on. Right, I'm gonna attach this. Fool me once, call me piggy. Fool me twice. Oh, you have to be kidding. Get in. There we go, right, okay. I'm willing now to strike a compromise and unleash you. How's that sound? Hopefully the power of Minecraft will let me pick that up. Yes, it did. Let's do the patented, uh, now we ought to sell these online. Stephen's patented, um, how do you tame cows? For that you need wheat from memory, which obviously we're building up to. Um, but we'll get there. We will get there. Because look, we have the startings. You start small, you build big. Before you know it, you're farming on an industrial scale. One more gate. Stephen the farmer's patented airlock system, which means no animals can escape. Um, I like it. I like it. I don't like that. Not, not one bit. I don't like that. But I do like that. There we go. Nice and safe. You like that, Piggy? Pork Chop loves his new home. Tell you what pigs do like. Tell you what pigs do like. Get back. Tell you what they do like. Let's give him. Oh, I've run out of water. Actually, do you know what? We've already learned. We've learned, haven't we, from the saga of Yes, get out of the way. We've learned this from the saga of our Wayne Ray. If you don't, no one, you shouldn't mess with animals or water. It's dangerous. There we go. So I think that is a suitable place to, uh, to end. I don't know about you guys, but I think we've had a pretty successful time here in the game. Thank you again to all the younger viewers and listeners. Daisy Digby Carter, Dougie Oscar, Lois, Harry Traguno, Mason the Fortnite Pro, Amy, Hannah and Ben, Devin Zilla and Daddy Zilla, Nathan and Ronan, Max, Charlie and Oliver, Max being the MC Master, Game Boy Matty, Daniel Ridge, Alex and Anna, Kane and Newbie. As we say, all good in the Minecraft wood. Um, yeah, doesn't really get any better. So join us tomorrow, 3 o'clock, for another uh, great stream. Speak to you all soon. Absolutely. Thank you, Steve. Uh, I will. Thank you, Rachel, stroke Oscar. Thank you, Retro Gamer Thomas. Again, thank you to Millie. You'll be watching this retrospectively, no doubt. She'll put herself through watching it all over again. Um, mine in the background. Pig's there. We've come a long way. So hopefully today we've stuck a little bit to our principles, we've expanded our starter home and added some details. We've got art inside, we've got smoke coming out the chimney, 
really doesn't get any better for that. Uh, we've got two dogs to help us get over the loss. We've got a llama who's now acting as a door. Um, thank you once again. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Subscribe, that would be absolutely incredible. Day made for me. Uh, tell all your friends, get them here tomorrow for another lesson, 3 p.m. UK time for another lesson in Minecraft. Thrive and survive. Take care, gamers.